special guest, Kylie. Hi. Kylie is my niece and they were here visiting from out of town and Kylie really wanted to be in some hairstyle tutorials and she has this lovely blonde hair. So we just thought, how fun, let's do some. Today we are going to show you guys the banded ponytail. And this is a great how-to hairstyle. It's super easy and it's great for holidays as well as just everyday use. But before we get to the tutorial, you guys, we are going to CVX Live. It is September 21st and 22nd in Salt Lake City, Utah, and there's gonna be so many awesome people there. I know Brooklyn and Bailey are gonna be there, Camry's gonna be there, as well as Rebecca Zamolo, Karina Garcia, Annie LeBlanc, and a whole slew of other people. If you want information on it, you can click the link in the description box below. You can buy your tickets down there too, or click the I button up here over my shoulder, and you can find all the information. We hope to see you guys there, so definitely check it out. And Kylie, let's get on to the hairstyle. Let's go. Now, to begin the how-to on this hairstyle, I have simply pulled her hair up into a really high ponytail, I left a few little wispies around her face just to soften the look, and I did wrap it with hair and then secure it with a bobby pin. You can see that this ponytail is nice and high, and I'm going to just split it into two equal sections, so just right in half, and I'm gonna pin um, half of it off to the right side, and we'll use that later. On this left strand, we're gonna do a three-strand braid. It's just a simple braid, and what you need to know is that every time you cross the right section over, you're going to have a little colored band on here. So you have your three pieces, like this. I'm gonna start with my first stitch right here, so I'm gonna add in my first colored band. I'm just gonna pull the hair through that, and then I'm gonna create the stitch. And then I'm gonna create the second stitch, and again, when I go to move that right piece over, I'm just gonna do it, make sure it has a hair elastic, colored elastic, put in place. And this looks really funny right now, but at the end you'll see there's a little bit of magic to this one. So every time you go from the right piece to the center, you're just gonna have a hair color on there. And the beauty of this hairstyle is you could really use it for lots of events. This one we're just doing rainbow just for fun, but you certainly could do orange and black at Halloween. You could do red, white, and blue at the 4th of July. So this becomes a holiday hairstyle as well. You could do lots of different colors. Springtime colors for Easter, it can be multifunctional for holidays. So we're just going, and as we're braiding, every single time that right strand crosses the middle, we add in an elastic. And you can do as many as you want, or as few as you want. I'm just sort of going down the length of her hair. And I'm kind of doing like an ombre effect from light to dark. When you get down to the bottom, you can just simply finish it off and then put in a little clear elastic for now. Now we're gonna go over to this, the strand, the other half that we had pulled to the side. Now we're gonna create a three strand braid again, but every time you take the left one in the middle, you're gonna cross it through the same elastics. So three pieces. So it's gonna cross over and then do our first stitch. Now we're gonna go through this one and then cross it over. And go through this one. So you can just see every time I'm pulling that left strand through the same elastic then crossing it into the middle. As you work your way down, it starts connecting the hair even more. You definitely want to make sure that your bands aren't too big. The smaller the bands that you can find, the better. Just they're going to hold the hair a little tighter together with less space in between. When you get down to the end, go ahead and add a few more stitches. And then you can just take the same elastic out and reconnect them. And then what I would do is take a couple of little blonde bobby pins and just connect those little braids on the back side even a little tighter just so it holds them together so that you have a nice look of connection between the two braids. And there you have 
There you have the cute little banded ponytail. All right, let's do the final spin on the banded ponytail. Love it. So cute, what do you think, Kylie? Awesome. Kylie said it kind of looks like stitches in her hair, and I kind of agree, it does kind of look like little stitches, multicolored stitches. Also, don't forget that if you switched out for red, white, and blue, or Easter pastels, or red and pink for Valentine's Day, or black and orange for Halloween, this would be a great holiday hairstyle option as well. Don't you think, Kylie? Yep. Would you wear this for Halloween? Probably. Yeah, it looks cool. All right, if you guys haven't already subscribed to our channel, be sure to click this button right here. If you wanna buy your CVX tickets, you can buy them by clicking right here. And if you wanna see other hairstyle videos, be sure to click the box over to that side. And we will see you guys next time. Sign us off, Kylie. Say bye. Bye, bye guys. <laughs>